thing than the Lucas. <laughs> My friends thought they was real smart coming up with a nickname that had more than one meaning, and I reckon so. I'm pretty nervous today. I've never been on a talk show before. I don't think I left the trailer park before. They kind of got me today with this lady, with this lady Oprah, and I and they was carrying guns and weapons. I thought they was going to tranquilize me and throw me in a cage. That's where my mama reckons I belong. But now Oprah's real nice. She done been real lovely to me today. She asked me if I could please um, come and talk to y'all today about what it's like being part of the inbred society. And of course, I agree. I'll tell y'all a bit about myself. When my daddy, Uncle Jeffrey, who's my daddy, died, he left me his trailer and I spent my entire life savings putting two extra sinks in it for my two extra heads, Georgia and Billie Jean. And then I realized I can't clean all my teeth at the same time anyway because I was only born with two hands. And then I thought about it, I could have bought myself a shovel and been digging holes in the backyard. My mama says I don't do nothing around the house. She's always like, Spaghettios, and I want ice cream, and I want them in my room in five minutes, young man, or I'll kick your chicken ass right out that door. <laughs> she always saying I don't do nothing. I just sit around and watch the TV and smoke my plants. <laughs> Me and my friends, we all smoke the same produce. My daddy set it up his very own plantation right out the backyard, right before he died of a lack of brain cells. <laughs> God rest his soul, he didn't have none left. <laughs> But uh, yeah, we all smoke it. But when I do, I look in the mirror, and ain't, there ain't three of me. There's six or seven. I don't need no friends. I can have an entire house party all on my own. <laughs> Except for there ain't no females present. You know, my lady friends, they all say I was born with three legs also. <laughs> One swinging clean along right down the middle. You know what I mean. <laughs> that joke was for the ladies, you homosexual. <laughs> Thanks for having me. I'll come back anytime you like, Missy. Bye! <laughs> 